Greetings. My name is Sam Cusimano, and welcome to Electricity for Progress. Today, we will be modifying a family favorite yodeling pickle for the Moogfest 2010 Circuit Bending Challenge. The yodeling pickle offers keen styling and an easy to use single button interface. Prepackaged with batteries, the yodeling pickle can be fun for the whole family. My batteries are dead. Let's see what we can find inside the yodeling pickle. Inside of the yodeling pickle, we find three button cell batteries, a small speaker, and the main board featuring the triggering button, a black blob IC containing the sampler, and a network of C1 and R1 that controls the playback rate of the sample. By modifying the value of R1, we can change the rate at which the sample plays back. For example, by moistening the tip of the finger and placing it on R1 while playback occurs, it should modify the sample's playback rate. Let's remove R1 and replace it with a potentiometer. Here I've pulled two pieces of wire from a sprayer printer cable that I found lying around. Printer cables are a great resource for raw materials when circuit bending. You can get them for free and they contain up to 25 leads each. Multicolors too. Very pretty. Let's tin up our wires and attach them to the circuit board. Very nice. Here, I've replaced R1 with a 1 meg potentiometer set up as a variable resistor. To give us some more visual feedback, let's add an LED. If we attach this LED across the speaker terminals, as current goes back and forth actuating the speaker, it should illuminate the LED. And with our LED in action. with the potentiometer and LED attached. Now let's fit these pieces into the body of the toy and drill some holes for final mounting. Hmm. Looks like that tiny potentiometer can fit right underneath the main board, right above where the button's pushed. 
and let's just put the LED a little bit above him. With the location of our holes marked, let's get out our handy Dremel tool and cut some holes. Always remember to wear protective eyewear when soldering and when cutting through plastic. Now to add the finishing touches. What we need here is a nice knob to cap it all off. Ah, a beaten painted chicken head. Well, that's going to look great. And there you have it. Ye old yodeling pickle. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Electricity for Progress on our MoogFest 2010 Circuit Bending Challenge submission.